We shot a cock car, everybody. What's happening? What's happening? What happening? <laughs> What's going on, y'all? I'm so glad I'm back in front of y'all again today. But look, we need to get some... <laughs> look, we need to get some things straight. And the thing I think we need to get straight is... Let's talk about the Squire bases, all right? Not the new ones. I'm talking about the old ones. And I ain't saying really particularly old, old. I'm talking about old ones. All right, so let's talk about them. All right, so let's, let's, let's sit down for a second. And the first thing I want to put up is this base right here. See that base? That's a Squire. That's a white on black Squire. We call it like a penguin or a tuxedo. See? It's a Squire. See? It's a, a beautiful Squire. It still got the um, plastic on it. <coughs> All right, so we're going to take a shootout today of this Squire and the, and the uh, Jaguar Squire, which is active. And that Squire right there, which is the Deluxe Squire. The Deluxe Squire, and that's active with a boost on it. So we're going to go past it first. Check this out. I want to kill that myth of, man, why why you playing a Squire base, man? I'm going to show you why today. I'm coming through my SWR um, 900 and my Aguilar GS. All right? GS, DBs. GS. Yeah. All right, so let's go with a rear pickup first on this base. This base is passive. This is a passive base, so let, let's not trip. It's passive. Rear, rear pickup. All right, front pickup. Now, I, I've done a little work on this one. But I ain't do that much work. It sounds like this. It's passive now. It's passive. No, no um, Aguilar's in it. No Delano's in it. No Bart's in it. No Lindy Fralins. I don't have Lindy in it. Now, I normally put Lindy in my stuff. I don't have no Lindy in it. I don't have anything like that. You know, EMGs, I nothing like that. It's just straight what it is. And I touched it. <laughs> All right. Both pickups, check it out. switch over the camera stops and I'm not gonna do all that so you know whatever the setting is on this thing that's what it's gonna stay because you gonna be you gonna look at me as I do this all right we're gonna set this over here out the way you get all that girl you stay over here out the way okay now let's pick up the Jaguar and the first thing I want to do basically is where did I put my cord all right I want to check the tuning again because the weather's changing here because I just turned the heat on. So that means that the room temperature is changing. Does that mean anything? Of course it does. If you're if you're in a cold room and all of a sudden your your room still warming up, you need to check the tuning of your neck. All right. You need to make sure it's cool. Don't think that <laughs> it's gonna stay the way it is because weather change it change. See, it's a little off right there. A little sharp right there. That's a little sharp. See? Alright, so let's check this out. Now, we're going to a passive uh, active base. This is the Jaguar. Let's take the take the tuner off. All these bases are squires, alright? Let's get that straight. They're all squires. 
Squire bases. Sweet. Check the Jaguar out. Beautiful. PJ setup. Active electronics. All right. No push pull. Anything like that. All right. This base is straight stock. Got a 9 volt battery in it. Got a skunk on the back. You can look at it and tell it's a Jaguar. And it's a Squire. <laughs> and she clean too. All right. So here we go. Now. Let's turn it on. Now this base is active. And the next base I'm gonna play is active. So that means I have to turn my amp down because it's gonna be crazy. So I turn the amp down. All right, we are. Now, let's go to the front pickup first. And when I go to the front pickup, I'm gonna play no bass and no treble. Just, just the way to pick up. Okay, now let's go to the rear pickup. All the way up the neck. Nice. Uh oh. Clean. Both pickups. Everybody knows that the PJ setup has a whole new different in your face than a double J. A double J is more straight up in your face where a PJ gets a little broader because of the P's. Now, let's dial in some, dial in a little bit of trouble. It don't have a D10 in it, so you got to figure out where the D10 is. Somewhere right there. Now, that's both pickups. I can turn it up a little bit. Now, front pickup. She's laying, she laying low too, cause you know I don't play, I don't play hard, and I don't want my strings way up there, so they kind of like almost under the fret. <laughs> Look, I said almost. Okay, let's go to the front. I mean the rear. That's that Jocko sound. So let's dial in the bass on D10. Somewhere right in there. Ask me what I gig with this bass. Ask me. Go ahead. Ask me. Of course I will. Now everything is at D10. Both bass, both pickups are on. Okay, now let's go trouble all the way. Oh my goodness, my God, and my goodness, and my God. Woo! Now let's go, <laughs> go bass all the way. Woo! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there, baby. with this bass think about it come on we're going to the next one now come on we got a couple of minutes here we go all right so we got that in Ooh. Ooh. now this is tobacco burst color i love this oh i love this all right so look at this one 
She's been through the whole Bold Depot too. Look at her. Woo! Nine volt battery. All right. It's a square. You're kidding me. No, I'm not. But thank you for asking. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Look, check it out. So first thing we need to do is tune it up. Make sure it's tuned. Because I don't want you perfect pitch, people. They come. Hey, what? Hey, hey. He didn't even tune the bass. It's out of tune. Okay. Thank you, here. Like I said, if you're in a place where the weather is changing, the neck will change. I don't care what kind of bass you got. You could have a, you know, Maserati, which is the Federo. It'll change if it's in a different place. Now, let's make some noise. Woo! Baby dog. Now, this one has a preamp in it, too. And it has a boost switch, which is like a funk switch or a cut switch. All right, so you have, you have volume, blend, and then, okay, volume, blend, and then you have bass and treble, and that mid right there. This joint right here ain't no joke. All right, so here we go. All right, so we're gonna turn it on. Here we go. <coughs> then I'm gonna turn everything off. Cause she ready to act up already. So here we go. All right, so the boost switch is off. You see how, 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 how bootylicious she sounds? Okay, so let's go to the rear pickup. some mids. Now on this bass you got detent. So the mids is at detent now. Now both pickups are on and the mids is at detent. Okay. Now let's dial the treble in at detent. Let's dial bass in at detent. So everything is at detent now. Okay, so now I haven't hit that switch yet. We gotta keep going. Let's go treble all the way. Let's go Miz all the way. Woo! Let's go bass all the way. Now everything is wide open, right? Check it out. Now let's hit that boost switch. Woo! That's like a cut. Well, watch this. Yo! What the 
world. <laughs> and there you have it. Squires on steroids. I'm telling you, Squires, do not take them lightly, folks. Do not take Squires lightly. I don't. Shady Kaka! I love Squires! And you should too. Peace out.